You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Item provided by Hexbug for review. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. I really appreciate it. I am finally getting to show you this BattleBots Arena. I do need to say thanks to Hexbug for sending this to me to check out on video. Now, I gave a hint of this in a previous video, and this is what everybody wanted me to do next. So I am going to check it out now, and I'll bring in my opponent later. But for now, I want to learn about it, set it up, and then play it for you today. It's ages 8 to 16. It's a 20-piece set. Now, as you can see, they do have some battery requirements here, so I'll go through that. Here is their social media, all for Hexbug.com. Now, I have been wanting to do this set for quite a while. I have been a big fan of BattleBots way before it was as popular as it is now. The show is currently running. I think we're in episode four or five by me. It's on every Friday night. And they haven't got to the semifinals yet, so they're still running through the list of BattleBots. All right, let's see. BattleBots Arena, modeled after television's favorite metallic war zone, comes the Hexbug BattleBots Arena. Watch head-to-head -head matches unfold inside the action-packed replica of BattleBox. A perfect place to pit the world's most notorious robots against one another. The Hexbug BattleBots Arena includes four sidewalls, two regular corners, and two corners equipped with interactive weaponry. A fold-out game board features authentic graphics and plastic panels, recreating the protective glass surroundings just like on TV. Each playset also includes two remote control battle bots, Tombstone, and Witch Doctor. The power of battle is in your hands. All right, so you battle. Uh, let's see, destroy your challenger, magnetize and snap together pieces, fly off upon impact, Pulverize the enemy, push activated hammers, slam down onto your unsuspecting opponent for game-changing sneak attacks. They show you the remote control here, the pieces in the kit. Let's learn about Tombstone. Here we go. This battle bot can be summed up in one word, deadly. Steer clear of Tombstone, the grave maker, with a sinister rotating blade. This worthy adversary is known to leave the competition six feet under. Rest in pieces, and then Witch Doctor, Prepare to be spellbound, wielding a sabotaging scoop front, wedge, and spinning vertical disc. This battle bot creates a magic we call chaos. For any opponent who dares to cross its path, conjure and conquer, easy assembly. Kind of reminds me of the pieces that were part of the soccer set, which I just showed you maybe about a week ago. So I'm going to come back now. Get this out of the box, and we'll learn how to set it up. All right, I've spared you some of the unboxing because there's a lot going on here. And I wanted to make sure that I was able to get it all back the way I originally took it out. So these are the last pieces. I thought it looked pretty cool in there the way that is. And it looks like I just need to cut up some of these little twisties that are here. I think we're good to go after this. Worst scissors I've ever had. There's, oh, my scissors I've broken. Hmm. I wonder why I was struggling there. All right. And then I think that's it. Oh, there's a slide. There we go. That slides this way. This slides this way. And that takes that out. And now my battle bots. Okay, these are twisted in. So this I'll be able to. Oh, I think I cut my other twist ties accidentally. A little bit different on both of those, the way those were packaged. Okay. How cool is that? Like I said, I have been a fan since the beginning. And it's definitely gained in popularity over the years. Oh, my magnetic pieces are falling off. Okay, how's that held on? Oh, wow, there's a lot going on here with this. Okay, so that's out. Okay, I'll need to figure that out because I dropped a piece. So when you're doing your unboxing, be careful because I don't know what comes off and what stays on just yet. Wow, cool mechanics in there. Very, oh, look at that. Yeah, pieces are just flying everywhere. That's the action we want to see, but not in an unboxing part. Okay. 
So this looks like it's, there we go. All right. How cool is that? There's all the pieces. Let me find what I dropped. And then I will find the instructions. Maybe they're folded up in here. Or maybe not. Since I've done this recently, I should just be able to. Okay, so here's everything for future reference. I will be right back then as I find the piece I dropped, get everything together, and set this up. Oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. All right, here we go. I finally got it all uh, kind of organized here. Now I noticed that when it was packaged in the box, they showed these two, well, that's just exactly how it was packaged. So the box though, the picture shows these one on each corner. So I guess it would depend if you're right-handed or left-handed, depending on which side, but they are opposite of each other. So I am going to put those in first, but to do that, the board here, I'll show you the back has little punch outs all the way around. So you have to get those out. Oh, I need a better light. Can you see that in the, there we go, right up here. You can see them right in there. They're all the way around. So you got to take all those out first before you can do anything. And that's, so you can slide in the pieces all the way around. Now I'm going to put the corners in first. That's what I found easier to do and then the other pieces just slide right in now I was looking at the little side panels they even have the saw blades or the screws in the sides like they have in the real show and then they have the saw blades that pop up So those are nice little obstacles that they throw in later. All right, so here's what I'm saying now. Ooh, one more. So I guess if you're left-handed and want to use your left hand and you put them here, if you're right-handed, I guess you can put them opposite. It doesn't really matter, does it? I guess. And then you just put these in here and then once they're in, you slide it over and then that locks it in. Let's get this one in the corner. Again, we will do it again. So you take this like this. We'll put this in here. And then slide it in. Okay, and then two more corners. Red team, are you ready? Blue team, are you ready? It is exciting. And then these just slide down. And then I don't remember them necessarily doing much, but pushing in like that. And that's pushed in. And you can see it's kind of in the sides here. Battle bots. And then the last thing is the glass panel. So we are almost done. It's a quick setup. Okay, and this is to keep the pieces probably from flying too far out. Now I can't think of the bot. This year was the first bot they said that had a launching projectile. And it didn't, oh, this is the wrong way. There is like a little lower area there that looks like that's supposed to fit into the slot. Okay. Uh, I think I have to make a little bit more room to get everything in the video correctly. Okay, simple enough. All right, so there's your little hammer action. Now these, I haven't done anything. They still have their batteries, it looks like, inside. Okay, we'll show you everything that does come off in just a second. So that is that, then the battery pull on this one and then you probably need to set this to one there's no other settings there's a power Ooh, let's see if it finds one right away sometimes you just hold the button down nice and here's my spinner Ooh, check that out Ooh, so you see that I just hit the side 
and I lost a piece. All right, so this pops off, this pops off, this pops off, and this does not go up and down. The flipper looks like it's not, there is no flipping action, but you get that spinner in front. Oh, you just press it once and it stays on. That's nice. I remember watching the one two stone Witch Doctor. And Witch Doctor was actually should have won. It got flipped over and couldn't write itself because it's spinner. It uses this to write itself and it cannot flip back over. So I think Tombstone got lucky on that one. All right, so this has a back piece that comes off and the top piece. Let's turn this one on. Pull. Second controller, switch it to two. All right, turn it off and on again. Hold down. I don't know if I turn it off. Okay, let's see. Let's get this one out. It might have accidentally sunk up with the other controller. Let's see. Oh no, that one's good. Oh, battery. Let me do this again. There we go. Oh, I can't wait to turn the spinner on on this one. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, let me put his pieces back on. Now they say it's safe to the touch. You do get a little, it says right here, safe to touch. But it does give you a little ting, like a little twinge when you touch it. It looks like the little sensors on the top of this one. It's a pretty nice size. I mean, you can, when I feel it in my hands, it's a nice size. Now, I don't know, does this go a certain, yes, it does. Okay, there we go. All right. I have a feeling that you're going to hit the edges a lot. So they basically each have three pieces that fall off, so I guess we'll play it that way. I need to find my opponent. Now that I've checked it all out, set it all up, it's time to battle. All right, I am back. I have found my faithful assistant. I mean, my opponent. My opponent, Elise. Yes. <laughs> she wants to battle me. She decided to pick Tombstone. Mm -hmm. So I will be the Witch Doctor. And I was a little confused there because I thought Witch Doctor had a flip up front. It doesn't. Yes. He just has a pushing wedge to get underneath. That right. would be cool, though, if he was able to flip and do his other main weapon. Yes. All right, so let's see. Now let's turn yours on. I'll turn my spinner on. Okay. I also did tone the lights down a little so they don't get a lot of glare. Turn those off because you are not allowed to have that revved up before you start. Yes. A lot of times they'll bring them out and they'll do their little dance. Sometimes they go out. Whoa, oh, sorry. Oh, oh, no. A piece. Yeah, let a me put piece. that back. A piece is falling off, people. Let's see if I can get my. Okay, there back. we go. Yeah, yeah mine. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. There, there's my little spin. Yeah. Now I need to come back. Yeah. 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 All right, bring yours back into okay, position. I don't think I can. That's okay. good. Doesn't have to be perfectly on. That's just so that go. you're facing okay. me. Now turn. There you go. There you go. Okay. Hey. Are you red team? Are you ready? Push your button. Beep. Blue team, are you ready? Beep! And then it's like, goom! Goom! And you get two, and then when it's green, it's time to go. So, you're going to lose three pieces, or I'm going to lose three pieces. That's when we know we won. Are you ready? Ding! Here we go. Action! Oh! Okay, you are hitting the wall. I'm stuck. Oh, no! Oh, wait! Not fair! Not fair! Hey, you didn't lose any pieces, and I lost all of mine on battle number one. All right. Yay! Let me uh, grab my pieces here. 
Oh, Hello. I'm still spinning. Hold on a second. Go. Let me put you back. Be nice tombstone, and stay over there. Tombstone, tombstone, yay! How did that happen? I, I hit the know. wall and everything flew off. Okay. Well, that, <laughs> my top piece almost came off. Yeah, and then it popped back up. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna next time. You got your I can't camera. Reach yeah, mine. you can't. Oh, that's too bad. I'm yeah. so sorry. I'll be over there like this. Come on over in this corner. I will. All right, test your main weapon. Okay. Here we go. Are you set? Wait, wait, One. Wait, 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 wait. What? Deet. Red team, are you ready? Deet. Blue team, are you ready? Beep. Ding. 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 Yes. Oh, I That's lost a piece. Oh. oh I got one more piece. Oh, no. I lost. Oh, I got my top. Two pieces left. Ah! Ah! Okay. Ah! Ah! Oh, no. Not again. Ooh, those back pieces are going to be tough. You can't get me. Oh, yeah. oh that's my own. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Return back to home base. Let me get this over here. Let me get my pieces. Well, that one's gonna be too far to reach. I gotta come around here, side. How's it going? Just like that? Well, you gotta make this sure it's flipped the off. right way. Ooh, let me turn off my. It's the right way, yeah. You'll see if it's not the right way. You'll feel it. Nope, that doesn't go that way. That's for sure. Nope. Flip it over. Aren't you? Oh, I think no, you got right. it. Yeah, I got it. There we go. Okay, so you've won two, and I've won zero. So I must, must redeem myself. <laughs> you gotta step your game up. Come on. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. All right, All right, let's do this. We'll get a little bit closer in now. In closer to the actual battle. All right, test your main weapon. All right. I gotta get the back of you. That's not fair, because mine are on the front, and yours yeah, are on the back. So true. it's hard for me to get to the back when you're... Going crazy. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. I'm going to control this with one hand and keep my hammer going. <laughs> okay. All right, are you ready? Yes. Red team, are you ready? <laughs> Blue team, are you ready? Oh, I'm stuck. Yeah, do your victory dance. Go ahead. 10, 9, 8, 7. Oh, you're not out, six. though. That's only if you get stuck. Yeah, I know. I was doing that for you. Oh, thanks. <laughs> That's so kind of you. Turn mine on. Yeah. All right, I'll tell you what, everybody. We are done. Yeah. But I'm going to do a little bit more. I think I want to get some close-up shots of both of us battling. So uh, we will stop talking now. Ooh, that was me on that. We will stop talking now and just have fun. And thanks for watching, everybody. And thanks for joining me, Elise. No problem. Even though you won every match. <laughs> Later. Bye. All right, let's get set up, and I'm going to try this again. Okay.
If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a Lucky Penny, pick it up.